I want to say, and I know that you know all the reviews have talked about it. I know you've had to talk about it in interviews, but I think it bears repeating. Um, one of the sort of exciting, again, the powerful things about the film is that being blind is not seen as an impediment to life. It is not even projected as a. As, as, as in fact a disability, you don't, you, your characters do not see themselves as disabled in any way. Um, was it, was it that something you guys sat on? You, you were very determined to put out there, and if so, was there perhaps someone that made you think or feel this way? Yeah, yeah of course, I that's yeah. what uh, I think is the is the biggest uh, thing that we take yeah. back from this film oh, is that yeah. you know when we researched. Right. I'll give you an example. Yeah. You know, my my dad is a very commercial maker. Yes. So he said that uh, is picture may one one dance number though has to be there. Yes. And uh, this is much way before when you were scripting. And right. I was like, uh, Papa, you know, I don't think uh, this can have that kind yeah. of a dance because they are blind. So I said, uh, you know, but I really want this to look very authentic, and yeah. uh, you know, we should not go over the top and stuff. So instantly he went on this research rampage, and he, on from YouTube, he uh, sent me. These videos, uh, this, these videos were important because it started off our uh, 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 journey of, of building the awareness in ourselves yeah. about the right. world of the blind. Right. He sent me videos where the blind were dancing, they were blind, uh, were, you know, they, the, all, they were doing yeah. everything and so beautifully and they were coordinating yeah. and all of that. And it opened, we were the ones who were blind. Absolutely. It opened yeah. our eyes. Like, I think yeah. you all, even it was a notion, I think, in all of us, our heads. So. Yeah, of course, we met uh, some of our blind friends. Right. There was no sign of any helplessness or becharapan. Yeah. In Not fact, when all, you meet yeah. them, they are smiling more than you and I. <laughs> there is something that is, that is, uh, that is fulfilling them. Yeah. And I think uh, sometimes when you don't have many, too many alternative choices in life, right. You only have a few yeah. and you do them well, yeah. it fulfills you. That's how they are. And I think that's something that we also learn from right. them. So uh, taking from all of that, yeah. we played Rohan and Supriya just like we are. We said that's we are right. going to just play this character. Of course, the skill of the blind attached yeah. to it. But we'll play it like you, you are yeah. and how I am. We are independent, yeah. exactly. we are self-reliant, yeah. self-sufficient. We're going to play it like... Yeah, we are conscious about even yeah. the way we look, the way we dress yeah. up. The shoes, that, that, the all shoes, of that, yes. everything. Yeah, yeah. We, uh, we've seen... Um, YouTube videos where young, visually impaired, beautiful girls are giving makeup and hair tutorials because when we were figuring out how to break down the look, yeah. uh, you know, we can't go overboard or how, how yeah, should yeah. the hair, as much as detailed, right. you know, that they are telling you this is the day look, that's the office look, that's <laughs> the party look. Right. I'm like, we are the ones yeah. who are actually uh, with uh, the blinkers on, yeah, right? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. We are the ones know, with the blinkers on. Uh, what I would, what I take from that is uh, on a broader scale, right. is you know the the they are they really serve as an example of uh, the human potential yeah and Absolutely. that is i think what we must all take back from this film right. if we can after the entertainment and all right. is over there are couples who are blind who live uh, with each other uh, they serve coffee to guests when they come over yeah. little little things uh, so what we must realize is that all of us just like them now they i'm just taking them using them as a symbol symbolic of the darkness that uh, that exists in all our lives in some way some part of our lives you feel little less about yourself so these are all the darknesses in our lives and what we must take from the blind is that that human potential that they have inside of them is exactly what we have inside of us so don't feel afraid of the darkness in your lives don't feel afraid of the adversity don't feel afraid of the uh, of the chaos or the confusion just keep moving forward, you know, know that you, your human spirit is very, very strong here. It will surpass, overcome anything in your life. All you have to do is decide and do.